Headlines like these are becoming our daily reality. The conflict between citizens and street dogs is reaching a breaking point. The problem isn't just the dogs, it's the information void. We have two tribes, the avoiders, who navigate by panic and rumors. These are mostly the normal citizens and the assisters, those who care for animals in isolations. The animal activists, both want safety, both want peace, but now has the data to get there. Enters Bildgard, the first civil tech ecosystem that turns chaos into verified intelligence. Reporting is instant. Citizens log sightings which are community verified to prevent abuse. They can also download an incident report and check the status of their report. This is the threat map. We have 200 plus verified hotspots released by the government in Delhi and CR. Red zones show aggression. Cyan dots shows verified feeding points. Admin can verify or reject reports. The location of the image and the place for where the report is given, if they are same or not, can be checked easily by the admin. In emergency resources, all the verified steps to be taken after immediately a dog bite are given. There is a directory of hospitals which treat rabies patients and all the numbers to which a citizen can call and ask for help after a dog bite. The safe route planner is just like Google Maps but optimized for safety. It analyzes risk data and recent incident reports to guide you around aggressive packs. We map feeding points. This coordinate feeding awares the citizens about the places designated by government to feed the street dogs. Plus, a built-in SOS shield for emergencies. Screen is recorded so that people have the evidence of the incidents for the court or police cases and insurance claims. And also alert is given to users in 100 meter radius to confirm the incident and help the person. We aren't just making a map, we are building the infrastructure for coexistence. We bridge the gap between fear and facts. My name is Sartu Gusai. And this is Bite Guard. Let's make our cities safe for humans and human for animals. Thank you.